treat me so right Girl, got this feeling that your love is gonna reach me tonight Hey y'all, welcome back to our channel, it's your KK and today I had to come to the farmer's market and usually it's just uh today trip to the farmer's market is gonna be for mainly produce and stuff but i decided to just we decided to get everybody out of the house let the kids come with us for a while walk around stay away from people and see what we can find healthy out here so yeah let's go y'all notice i put the wig back on i work with it y'all what you think Ugh. it's not that bad i still gotta get used to it some more though but it's growing on me i'm getting used to it this girl act like she can't pass up a damn instrument without touching it i hope they locked it i hope it's closed yes ha ha good <laughs> yes who needs to be nobody needs to be playing no public piano anyway Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> COVID-19 say shut all that down. This is our first time going to the farmer's market since this whole pandemic thing, since they opened back up. And I'm kind of curious to see how everything goes, how it works. Go to the Give me your hand. Huh? What you gonna do over there? Go ahead. You got this shirt on inside out. What it feel like? Gonna be a star one day? Go King! Woo! King! King! Is that how you gonna treat your pants? <laughs> you gonna just stare at him? <laughs> I guess you say it's probably crazy. Okay, you ready? Come on. Who are you looking at the lights? <laughs> well, back when everything was normal pre COVID, like this whole street would be full of people. But, like, right now, all we can do is walk on the sidewalk. And I'm trying to figure out how to get over there so I can get me some goods. See, look, like that good old honey right there, them fresh produce. Yes. That's what I'm here for, stuff that comes out of the earth. Organic, fresh. I'm trying to figure out how to get in this thing, though. I think I figured it out. I hope I brought enough money. Under 20 minutes. Hello guys, have you completed the census? Huh? Have you completed the census yet? If yeah. You can do it here? Okay, great. Yeah, thank you. All the fresh produce, y'all. What is this? Back up, back up. No, y'all can't touch, I don't think. Hi. Huh? What's this? That right there is a bitter melon. A what? Bitter melon? Bitter what? Melon. Melon. It's really bitter, but the, the people buy it because what's called the health benefits for this one is really good. It helps with diabetes, high blood pressure, cholesterol. What's this? Uh, that's the cousin to the bitter melon. That's Chinese bitter melon. It's less bitter. That's open, that's part of the squash family. You use it kind of just like you can, chop it up and then put it in boiled water. You can chop it up and then uh, boil it with chicken. It's pretty good. Okay. We have a lot of exotic stuff. I see, I'm looking. That's a gooseberry. Is this a regular with seeds? Uh, some we have seeds, some we don't have seeds. I'm not too sure if this one has seeds in it. I would have to ask the boss. Okay, I want seeds. I don't like seeds. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's okay. Kind of, kind of, kind of. Uh, this one's 
Yeah, I don't have anything good right here for a while. What's that? What about that right here? Uh, this one? Yeah, like since you don't They got stuff I don't even know what to do with, uh, y'all. <laughs> Babe like okra and I don't, and I don't know how to cook it. That watermelon over there showed the hair don't look like it's no seedless. And that baby look like it comes straight out somebody's garden. And what kind of tomato is this? So this one right here is a black zebra. This is a brandy one, a Cherokee, and then a pineapple. Pineapple, and These are the Cherokee. heirloom tomatoes, so they're a little sweeter than your regular store-bought tomatoes. This is our store-bought tomato. Not store-bought, but dude. The beef steak, which are store I recommend it. Make a sweet salsa. Y'all want to try some different tomatoes? How about that one? It looks like it's split though. Oh! That's it. That nature food be ugly. There you go. That's a good one. Pineapple tomato. You want me to make you some okra? <laughs> Why not? Why? You don't like my okra? <laughs> I don't know either. There you go. We got us a real watermelon. Finally. And we just spent our whole cash, all the cash. All the thought, I don't know why I thought we only would need $20. So I guess we can go home now. Because I did want to get some fresh organic berries and things, but I ain't got no more cash. And I don't, I know they don't take ca uh, cars around this camp. You want some berries? You don't have no more cash? Yeah, I do. Oh, you do? You got honey, huh? Yeah. We gotta start getting our honey from the farmer's market. Make sure we real, real. I'm waiting in line. I don't post. I don't post to wait in line. <laughs> Can I get this one? That one? Yeah. Ten dollar. What you getting? Hummus. Hummus. He loves him some hummus. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. yeah. All the different hummus. Thank you. <laughs> the farmer's market. I said they got everything at the farmer's market. Mm -hmm. See, this is what vegans eat, y'all, for goodies. This is our goodies. Y'all chips and things. That's it, that's, we done. I'm gonna show y'all what I got when I got home. So real quick, what I got, and then I'm gonna put it up. I got some bell peppers and that uh, pineapple tomato I was telling y'all about, remember? Here we go. See how that tastes. And I got a bunch of strawberries and blueberries. That thing's sweet. Can I taste the blueberries, mommy? Can I taste Hold on, I got a white sugar. Hmm. Yummy. Yummy? Mm-hmm. Blueberry. Sweet. Yeah, sweet. I don't want to buy no more strawberries from the store. Yeah. I only want to get them from the farmer's market now. 